A solemn ceremony calling attention to missing adults. More than a dozen families came to City Hall today bringing pictures of their loved ones who are still missing. We know somebody somewhere knows something of each and every one of our loved ones. Action News Jack's Brittany Donovan shows us how this event brings the families both comfort and hope. John Rowan was 34 years old when the father of two put in his notice at work. It was Thursday, February 22nd, 2001. On Friday morning at 5.20, he went missing. On Saturday at 3 o'clock, foul play was suspected. And we're still waiting on answers, 18 and long, lonely years. Rowan's family isn't alone in their agony. They stood in solidarity with other families at City Hall in Jacksonville Friday. Each yellow ribbon pinned to a shirt and yellow rose cradled by a family member, a way to keep their loved one's memories alive. Each of these photos represents a loved one who disappeared from our area without a trace, leaving families searching for answers, sometimes for decades. Community leaders say the smallest piece of information could lead to a break in any of these cases. The families will soon get more help through a new cold case initiative at the state attorney's office. As for Peg Rowan, she says she lies awake each morning at 520, wondering what happened to her son. But she's not giving up hope. I just want to find justice for my son. Reporting in Jacksonville, Brittany Donovan, CBS 47, Action News, Jax.